yeah uh, as uh, today uh, we are going to be discussed about uh, space wave propagations and its uh, core concepts right this many days uh, we have discussed about core concepts of ground wave propagations right today uh, we are going into the core concepts of uh, space wave propagations uh, in that uh, firstly primarily uh, one of the important topic we are going to be discussed about field strength variations with distance and height with respect to space wave propagations right in this uh, you people uh, now just analyzing a figure right in that uh, this particular arc what you seeing i mean uh, is noticed as at the surface and uh, we have a transmitter antenna on the earth surface and also we have a receiver antenna and for this transmitter antenna is uh, with some antenna height right the receiver antenna is also with uh, some uh, receiver height right yeah see here uh, just uh, we are taking uh, a point which was uh, center of, i mean center of core of the earth with uh, a, uh, noticing it as zero i mean sorry o right see here we have a transmitter antenna and also we have a receiver antenna with their respective to height and also we have a uh, center core point o okay and the distance from the transmitter antenna to this particular center point o is noticed by r and also distance between receiver antenna and this center point o is noticed as r right see here and also um, we have a point here which was the center of the earth surface and also we have a point is a core uh, at the center i mean center of the earth surface to core at the center this distance is noticed by r right and also in this particular concept we are going to be uh, i mean uh, we are going to be calculate the range of the transmitter antenna and also range of the receiver antenna the primary aim the primary motto of this concept is to estimate or calculate the range of the transmitter antenna and also range of the receiver antenna right see here in this figure uh, we have noticed something called rt and uh, rr right take this particular point as a uh, uh, centric point of the other surface uh, from the center point to transmitter this particular area what we know uh, what we noticed it has indicated as rt right range of the transmitter and also from the point to the receiver this particular side this particular distance is noticed as range of receiver that's what we have to estimate i mean we have to estimate the uh, transmitter range and also we have to estimate the receiver range right yeah see here and also these particular two antennas are yellowest to each other i mean uh, line of sight to each other right and also this particular signal is able to touch the earth surface right not touch it but able to touch the earth surface right and also these two antennas are uh, quite uh, line of sight to each other see here rt is nothing but range of the transmitter antenna right rr is nothing but the range of the receiver antenna ht transmitter antenna height hr receiver antenna height now uh, in this particular concept uh, we are going to be calculate and now to calculate the range of the transmitter antenna and also range of the receiver antenna right from the transmitter side triangle see here just uh, you uh, focus on this particular uh, diagram uh, here uh, we are noticing two uh, triangles right see here this is one of the triangle I mean this is a transmitter side triangle and also this is the one of the triangle this triangle is nothing but receiver side triangle I mean uh, we have noticed two triangles here this is one and also this is one right see here from the transmitter side triangle now we have a theorem right we have a uh, Pythagoras theorem what Pythagoras uh, theorem mainly uh, states that the diagonal square is equal to the both side squares i mean uh, such uh, take a transmitter side triangle in this uh, diagonal is this i mean from the uh, this side is a diagonal side right uh, diagonal square is equal to the both side square i mean diagonal square is equal to both sides i mean uh, both side one side is rt and other side is r right see here uh, just by taking this particular uh, statement uh, we are implementing a expression and we are uh, getting a output for this particular triangle right see here rt square i mean uh, both sides square one of the side is rt right both sides square i mean rt square plus uh, r square i mean uh, it is also 
one of the side right r square is equals to diagonal square ht uh, plus r whole square diagonal square right rt square and also r square is equals to ht plus uh, r whole square now expand this rt square plus r square is equals to ht square plus r square plus 2 htr right just now uh, just uh, do one thing just cancel this particular r and uh, i mean uh, cancel this particular r square and this particular r square right just see here after cancelling that we have rt square we have ht square and also we have 2 htr in this particular i am uh, i mean this particular ht square is quite uh, negligible right why this ht square is negligible right now see here we have rt square right here see rt i mean we have a distance right for rt we have distance from the transmitter to this uh, earth surface center right this particular distance uh, will be in words of kilometers right i mean uh, the distance between this particular uh, transmitter uh, antenna to this particular uh, point i mean uh, that uh, obviously that will be in kilometers right and also uh, just take this r htr see here htr i mean the distance between this particular antenna to this particular uh, point o this particular uh, distance will be also in words of kilometers right i mean obviously it will be in kilometers but the ht square i mean here this uh, ht means uh, uh, we can notice that is uh, antenna height right antenna height right this antenna height it will be in uh, uh, i mean uh, fundamentally the ht the height of the antenna will be in meters right not uh, kilometers because this is the height of the antenna is the height of the antenna will be in uh, kilometers no it will be in meters that's what when we compared ht square with this particular r or this particular rt square these both are in kilometers but this uh, ht is in uh, meters right when we compared the these three this ht is quite lower and because it is in meters right these two are is in quite higher because they are in kilometers that what ht square is quite negligible right see here now uh, ht square is negligible right see here uh, i mean uh, for your convenience i have given a note because of because the ht square is in uh, terms of kilometers right and also in uh, 2 htr r is also in terms of kilometers right but ht square is in terms of meters because it is the height of the antenna it should be in meters not kilometers right uh, when compared the ht square is lower than the rt square and r so by negl uh, by neglecting ht square this particular uh, equation will be evolved see here already here rt square and rt square is cancelled right by neglecting this ht square what we are seeing here rt square and also 2 htr right that's what uh, by neglecting htr we will get a expression uh, quite called rt square is equals to 2 htr now the range of the transmitter antenna i mean rt right then now the range of the transmitter antenna rt is equals to root 2 uh, htr just take that square and make as a root right and make it as equation 1 similarly now the range of the receiver antenna uh, by taking the receiver side triangle we will get uh, spontaneously same identical expression as uh, here it is transmitter side it is the receiver side just uh, we will get this particular equation by going through this particular uh, um, approach what we done now right uh, rr is equals to root 2 hrr just make it as uh, equation b or equation 2 uh, it's your convenience right now uh, we have to evaluate the total range right total range of transmitter and also receiver right uh, the total range of los that's what we have i mean i have explained uh, we have two antennas right they are quite line of sight to each other that's what the total range of line of sight uh, we can make it as small r the small r is nothing but total range of los small r is equals to uh, this particular rt plus this particular rr just substitute the root 2 HTR and 2 uh, HRR, right? Yeah, that's it. Thank you.
it is a very important question yeah just note this and just go through this particular concept also thank you